Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another episode of Vlogmas. Hold on. I'm just getting off of work, so I need to get myself together real quick. But yes, hi everyone. How are you guys doing? How are you enjoying Vlogmas so far? I hope you guys happen to have what? You know what I'm trying to say. Um, but it is Thursday. It's like 4.30. I'm just getting off of work. And I'm getting off of work later than I normally do because this brunch is taking forever to close and do and whatnot. But um, I decided to pull up my camera and vlog today just because um, I uploaded my Christmas decor. I can't go that way. I uploaded my Christmas decor. Um, not my Christmas decor. My decorate my bedroom for Christmas with me video and everything. And, you know, when I was doing my haul, when I was purchasing the stuff, like, I knew that the stuff that I got in red, the Merry Christmas sign, and that snowman was going to be a little, was going to be pushing it maybe because of the color and it wasn't really going with my theme. But I thought the area that I was putting it in, that it would be fine. I hate going, I hate trying to turn left on a busy street. But after decorating and put everything up, I'm just like, nah, this isn't, this isn't it. Like, this is where they throwing me off. So... I'm on my way to Target to return that Merry, the Red Merry Christmas sign and the like snowman nutcracker that's count down to like to Christmas. For why I feel like I can't get my words out. I just wanted to hop in here and start the vlog off. I know sometimes when I'm starting to vlog off, I get carried away and just talking, talking, talking about what it is that I'm going to be doing, everything within a video. And like I said in another video, I'm trying to do better with showing you guys what I'm doing because that's what a vlog is versus just saying it. So I see I'm going to get to Target again. I feel like every single upload vlogmas up episode i've been in target i've been in target every single time target got a chokehold on the girls for real okay y'all say so y'all already know what i'm about to say my battery got two bars which means we're gonna be dying soon so hopefully this should be fast it shouldn't be that long but we up at target got my stuff here but i'll show you guys even though i'm pretty sure you guys are gonna remember because i only have two red things but pretty much this merry christmas sign and this nutcracker and the tag is still on both of them because I had a feeling I was going to return it. Disrespectful! I don't even know who you are either. It's a spam. So, I have two things. I have a pickup order. And then I want to try and see if I could return this. I did, I got this with the return, so I'm pretty sure fine with the gift card or the store credit. There we are. Oh. Okay, you're all set. Thank you. Can I get that bag again to put the shoe on there? Okay, so we did the return. Um, I'm in the pajama section because like I said, I would take the money either put it towards pajamas or towards that tree. But if I put it towards my pajamas, I'll probably put it towards this one. It's like the red flannel or the white and black one. Let's go look and see what the decorations look like and then I'm gonna be switching the phone footage because my camera is about to die. That's my throw that I got. It's still $15. And then my favorite spot, home decor. So this is the calendar that I was talking about and I ain't had to, I guess I didn't have to do that pickup order because it's still a whole bunch in here. And I could have put this, or what I just returned towards it. Guys, do we think these two together look right? This little, thing and then my birch tree because they don't have so this typically comes in two sizes the big one which is what i got and then a smaller one which is 10 but they don't have the smaller one so i'm trying to think if just like this next to it will look okay but i don't know i mean i think so because you see some of the like wood in it so i don't think it would look that bad but it's two different things so maybe not now i'm in the wonder shop section because i feel like the home decor stuff is starting to die down this sign was and where it would fit in my space the back of it has like a little kickstand so that way you can like take it out and like it lays back at an angle i don't like that for this because i feel like it's taking up space so what i'm gonna do is i had a kickstand out and just sit it up like i did the other side and just sit it up against my wall and hopefully 
nothing happens. I don't think it'll fall, but yeah. And then I was gonna do something like this, but I don't know if I like that. At least I don't know if I like my fragrance rack being right here. I think I look better on my backdrop. And the D is very awkward. I have no clue. Wanna hang out with my friends and family. Make it angels in the sand you let me. Doesn't matter, it is Christmas in my heart. This part of the video is in collaboration with my girl Kyla over at Holistically Lit. Thank you so much, girl, for sending me over some of your wonderful smelling candles. If you guys are looking to support a small Black-owned business this holiday season, this is the perfect company for you to choose from, especially if you are a candle lover like I am. I do have a coupon code for you guys to use, so make sure to stay tuned so you can see what it is. And definitely go ahead and check out Kyla over at Holistically Lit. I will leave the link down below in the description box. Okay, so the first one we're going to smell is the is that pie eye smell. Um, mm. This one smells really, really good. This smells really good. I'm trying to pinpoint what pie she's trying to go towards. Is it sweet potato pie, pumpkin pie? But it smells really, really good. This definitely gives me winter holiday um holiday time if you guys like scents that smell like marshmallows and like hot chocolate and like all them different winter scents that bath and body works will sell i think you guys will like this one is that pie eye smell i don't know if this is just like a um seasonal one or not but this one smells really really good then this one is the honeysuckle jasmine i'm not sure what jasmine smells like i have no clue but let's go ahead and sniff it mm. This smells good. This smells like a clean, fresh scent. This is giving me like just hopping out the shower, putting on one of them white cozy robes, and just like relaxing. This is the vibes that I'm getting for this. Like, so if you like candles, like in your bathroom or whatnot, when we're taking a bath, you want to lit a candle. I think this will be the perfect candle for that. So we're gonna go ahead and swap out my bright Christmas morning. I just want to show you guys the inside of this. Like the instructions just say to you know cut the wick like a quarter of an inch. Or whatever and i think that i shouldn't say i think the ashes like fell and got into the wax while it was burning so now i have like this like ash ring and when it burns it's like really really dark i'm like halfway gone like it's like where is it my fingers right here i have this much left in the candle i've only been burning it for two weeks so definitely had to replace this so i'm gonna go and put this on hold for a second and we're gonna burn the is that pie i smell Christmas tree, oh Christmas tree, the 